Good afternoon, my name is Sean. I'm a preacher. I came out here to tell good news about Jesus Christ, the Messiah of the world. You know, Jesus Christ said, I am the way, the truth, and the life, and no man comes to the Father but by me. That's good news. Now, there's some of you that are probably thinking, I don't want to listen to Sean. I didn't come down here to hear about Jesus Christ. And yet, this nation is still considered a Christian nation. A lot of people say, I go to church. I give money to church. I read my Bible. I pray. It's foolishness to those that are perishing. But to those that are saved, it's the power of God. So if you love the message of Jesus Christ, friends, you're not perishing. If you hate the message of Jesus Christ, guess what? You get to go to hell. I mean, I'm telling you guys this, that God is love. And he says in his word that he loves you so much that he gave you his only begotten son. That if you would believe in him, you shall not perish. But have everlasting life, eternal life, forgiveness. So I ask you today, do you know Jesus Christ? Everybody says, oh, God loves everybody. My question today is, do you love God? Have you surrendered to him through repentance and faith? You say, why do I need to repent? Well, friends, the Bible says that none are good, no, not one. That would include liars. That would include someone that's stolen anything, regardless of the value. Maybe they dishonored their parents. I tell you today, my friends, that we're not good. That's why Christ Jesus came to this world. As God. There's no such thing as good or bad. Bro, so is it okay to bless little boys like Sandowski did? Tell me, sir, you don't want to have little boys here today. You're telling me that that's okay to do. No, there's a lot of people in this world. People are stealing things. People are, people are murdering. Who created those people? Who created the people to steal? They're evil.
I'm trying to be quieter. I want you to know about Jesus Christ being the only way to heaven. Evidently, there's some people that are offended when I tell them that Jesus is God and He's the only way. Friends, if you've ever lied, stolen, lusted, blasphemed, maybe dishonored your parents, the Bible's very clear. Hellfire awaits you. The Bible says, We're all going to stand before God and be judged. And if Jesus Christ, in His mercy, His love for mankind, is willing to grant His forgiveness by the blood that he shed <coughs> 2,000 years ago on a cross and then defeated death three days later. That's the good news of Jesus Christ. If you would believe in Jesus Christ, you can be saved. But saved from what? Hell, fire, judgment. From your sin. From yourself. From myself? What's wrong with me? I don't know. Are you a good person? Yes. <coughs> have you ever lied before? Yes, I have. You're not good. You see, people boast of their own goodness. Have you lied, though? I'm wicked. I'm, I'm, the, I'm like the poster child of, of like bad. Like Michael Jackson thought he was bad. I'm like, I'm like, I am bad. Super bad. Yeah. Well, I've like not just lied maybe twice or three times. I've probably lied a thousand times. How is everyone lie? Just because a lot of people do. If a rapist rapes ten people, everyone says, yeah, let's go rape people. Everyone's doing it. No. You see, morality is based on public opinion. Like, oh, it's popular to rape people this month. No, it's wrong to rape people. Yeah. Well, there you go. Now we're talking. Now we're finally like, it's not. Lying in God's eyes. See, God is holy. You've got to realize that God is holy. He's set apart. He's the creator. We're his creation. Who decided that it's one person controlling everything? That's a great question. God decided. It's really simple. Creation, creator. You know, you don't have to be a brain surgeon to look at God's creation and say, you know, that was a creator that
that made that creation. But how do you know that we didn't just come from that Because God didn't like, tell us we evolved. God said he created everything in how many days? Have you been reading your Bible? The Bible says that God created no, everything. In, the Bible says that God created everything in six days. He rested on the seven. Do you think it would take God seven days to make all this? Sure. It's only six. Just six, not seven. I don't think seven. God made everything. Well, it doesn't matter what you think, it matters what is true. Okay, well, in my truth, in my truth, the atheism is Buddhism. Yeah, Buddha came before Christ. Christ. So if Buddha was the way to heaven, Jesus would have said, listen, oh, it's not heaven. you guys follow Buddha, because he's going to get you to heaven. So Jesus said, I'm going to get you to heaven. I'm going to shed my blood. Why do people want to go to the grave? And then what happens to the grave? Why do you want to go to heaven? My wife wants to know what kind of pizza you guys like. He came back from the grave. Uh, but why, why would you want to go to heaven? About, uh, it really anything. This is about how, like, she... It's about God, God. God. Jesus Christ, salvation, by uh, repentance. See, God, I don't need to. If, 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 if rubbing Buddha's tummy is enough to get to heaven, then we'd all be doing all the time. That has nothing to do with Buddha. Yeah. 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 You'd be rubbing his tummy. That has nothing to do You'd be like, oh, here I go to heaven. I'm going to rub his tummy some more. I'm going to shine it up a little bit. Here you go. Shine it up. No. It's about the blood of Jesus Christ. But I don't care about it. No, 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 no. That's not what's important. The important thing is God's glory. God's name being glorified and lifted up. Don't reject it. Don't suppress it. Don't reject it. You can be forgiven for your mind that you said you're a liar. That doesn't make it right. Just because everyone goes around and murders people doesn't make murdering right. I mean, come on. Let's talk about this logic. I mean, it's illogical not to want to talk to one about it Jesus Christ. So guys, I'll encourage you today to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Do you guys believe? You're an atheist. What are you? Christian, what are you? Christian. Okay, good. Two Christians and one atheist. Christians win today. Christ, Christ's name needs to be lifted up. You Christians need to share your faith, turn from your sin, and live your life to glorify God. Thank you very much for listening today. Christian 2, Atheist 1. Thank you very much for listening. Thanks for the